that's because of its strategic location, you know, over the history, right? Uh, British wanted it, mm -hmm. right? Japanese wanted it, right? And now in, 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 in strategic competition, China wants that. China needs it, actually. I mean, I, let's take this out a little bit wider mm -hmm. and talk about the Indo-Pacific. Mm -hmm. you know, why is Myanmar important to the region? Well, yes, I'm glad you asked that because right. Myanmar is, is situated as a very um, strategic location, mm -hmm. right? It's at the doorstep of China, back mm -hmm. door of China into the, uh, into the uh, Indian Ocean, right? It's at the mouth of the Malacca Strait. And Myanmar has about 2,000 kilometers of coastline. You know, that coastline lead mm -hmm. into the entrance to the Malacca Strait. The back door to the, to right. the ocean. Right. Yeah, so, so it's on the Myanmar sits at the western opening mm -hmm. of the Malacca Strait. You know, eastern opening mm -hmm. is, you know, the South China Sea, right, mm -hmm. in that. So um, that's because of its strategic location, you know, over the history, right? Uh, British wanted it, mm -hmm. right? Japanese wanted it, right? And now in, 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 in strategic competition, China wants that. China needs it, actually. Right? And China, of course, in this strategic competition, is all about two systems. Mm -hmm. One, you know, one is a representative liberal democracy, and another one is authoritarianism. Right. right? And so, China wants stability in Myanmar. It doesn't want what it is right now, but it does not want mm -hmm. democracy, really. Right. So, so Myanmar is also because of that you know uh, uh, current situation mm -hmm. with the two system competing mm -hmm. right and Myanmar is right now at the heart of, uh, at the front line mm -hmm. of this democracy right so demo we talked about democracy and decline in Myanmar is a peril it's mm -hmm. a peril right so uh, but the, the the good news is that 99% of the people want democracy unlike its neighbor some of the neighbors you know there was a huge swath of people that like the current system they don't really want true democracy in Myanmar everybody wants that mm -hmm. really 99 percent of it want that right so if we are able to restore democracy in Myanmar at China's doorstep it will send a huge message right mm -hmm. that the democracy prevails mm -hmm. right so it's, it's beyond just Myanmar. And, and, and I think the region is also looking mm -hmm. at it, how we're going to, we as the mm -hmm. United States, right, are, uh, we're the, the, the flag bearer, right, of democracy. When it's coming to democracy, mm -hmm. everybody look up to us, right? right, right. So we say that democracy is important, mm -hmm. so then we need to back it up with mm -hmm. action. Right. Right, and to make sure that Myanmar prevail, Myanmar people prevail. Mm -hmm to, you know, a uh, uh, democracy. And it will send a huge message, I, I think, throughout. But as well as the, you know, the current situation, uh, the security situation is dire mm -hmm. because of the, you know, it's ungoverned spaces, right? And the conflict, and there are a lot of um, uh, 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 conflict, and it's create situation for some of the bad mm -hmm. actors right. to take advantage of, and that can spill to the, the rest of the region.